Hey guys, how are you all doing? It's Kayung here and I'm on my Opskine rotation and today I am on 24 hour call. So I just wanted to turn on the camera and check in because today it's been really interesting. So, um, where do I begin? My day started at 7.30 with handover and today I'm working with a preceptor who I have worked with before at her clinic as well as um, at the hospital on call. But today it's just me and I don't have any residents with me. So today's been very busy. I haven't sat down for more than like 15 minutes other than writing up consults. It's 3 p.m. right now and we have had four scheduled c-sections and for three of those patients I've already met them at her clinic. So she also is part of an MFM clinic and um, one of them was a die-die twin pregnancy and we had one with hypertension and gestational diabetes and the third one also had some medical conditions so today was really cool because i actually knew the patient's history already they know me i've seen them at least twice and i finally got to meet their babies um so I'm actually just coming back from the fourth C-section and um, I first assisted all day today. That usually consists of me holding the retractor, pushing the baby as it comes out, and re-approximating the subcutaneous tissue and doing the suture. Outside of the OR, I also check in on patients in the assessment room, which is um, like a labor and delivery emergency area almost, um, because some of them, they come in, they get checked and go home, and other times they come in and they start laboring and they get admitted. I've seen a couple of patients in the assessment room for induction of labor. One of them was post dates, which means they're past uh, 40 weeks gestational age. I think she's admitted currently and the other one, um, she has underlying hypertension. So um, also here for induction of labor. Yeah, so that's uh, what my day has been like so far. I also want to show the surgical cap I'm wearing right now. My mom and I made it together when I went home in the summer and we made about 10 and I've given away I think the four at this point. Um, so yeah, there. I, I like it. <laughs> and we have four different designs. Yeah, so like I said, it's 3 p.m. right now and I had half a piece of bread that my partner and I made over the weekend and I'm really hungry so my preceptor kindly let me take an actual break and eat proper food and I'll show you what I have for lunch so this is my lunch and my partner um, as always he made this for me I'm very lucky so this is rice with quinoa um, and some turmeric that's why the rice is yellow and we have stir-fried beef and vegetables hey guys it is 7 p.m. and I am here to have dinner I'm having the same thing as lunch because I only ate half of it so I'm gonna finish it and I also have this yogurt um, our student lounge has some snacks like yogurt, cheese ice cream so um, I'm gonna have this as a dessert I guess just to just to update on how my day is going um, I had two emergency consults which means I um, go to the emergency and see patients who have been referred by the emergency physicians for gynecology consult so I take their history and examine them um, and we had two patients one of them um, came in with a history of recurrent ovarian, ruptured ovarian cyst. And this time she has um, a two day history of acute right lower quadrant pain. So we're going to bring her to the OR and do a diagnostic laparoscopy. The other patient, um, unfortunately she had a stillbirth recently. 
and she still has some routine placenta in her uterus. So we're going to bring her to the OR as well and do a dilation, curettage, and suction. So that's going to be, those two things are going to be in the next eight hours, hopefully, which means since it's 7 p.m. right now, um, could be as late as like two or three in the morning. So um, it should be an interesting night for sure. Yeah, I actually, I've been really enjoying today so far. Um, I've been learning a lot and I'm working with a wonderful preceptor. Okay guys, um, it's 9 a.m. and I am finally done my shift. So um, overnight we had one emergency C-session and one laparoscopy for ovarian torsion and then I had one patient in labor. So I was up quite late but I was able to get a few hours of sleep. This morning I checked on my postpartum patients to see how they're doing and um, they're all doing really well and I was so happy to see their babies. So I'm gonna go home and get some sleep. Bye.